All right, ladies and gentlemen, you know what you're in for. It's part two of the Obsidian Flames booster box opening. Because apparently 18 packs is the limit of what I can open per video. Too many. There's too many. Nah, it's like, uh, I split it up because I'm being lazy. But all right, let's get back into it. That, that thing worth a hundred and how many? Damn, bro, these booster boxes are expensive nowadays. But here it is, guys. We're going to go ahead and shuffle it up real quick. Smash like before we get into it. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you're new to the channel, I'd like to welcome you. Go check out all my videos. From now on, you will be harassed by me to go and check out every one of my videos on a daily basis. Go check them out, even the gaming ones, please, and leave likes on them. Yeah, baby. All right, let's see if we can get, honestly, deadass. Let's see. Can we get this video, like, even 10 likes? Can we even get 10 likes, guys? Like, please? Jeez, Louise. Goddamn, giving out QR codes left and right, and y'all can't even like the video. Holy crap. So ungrateful. But anyways, here we go. First pack. If you haven't smashed like for first pack magic yet, you're a loser. And that's why I got an average pool. Um, thank you for being a dick. <laughs> you guys are dealing with the jerk wizard tonight. But nah, seriously, let's see. Leave a, con leave a comment below if you watched Left Side. And let me know if you're here to uh, undoubtedly insist upon that left gang is better than right gang. Please do so in the comments below right now. Um, but however, if you've seen the end of this video, I almost did it again. Let me know what side of the booster box won. All right, this is the right side. That was the left side. I have all the left side hits there still. I'll show you them all at the end. Pretty sure y'all are going to be very familiar with all of these commons and uncommons by the end of the video, as will I. Noticing not many trainers, which is weird, right? Because I feel like uh, with Paldea and Scarlet and Violet, like, we've got so many trainers in every single pack. There was like at least two. I don't know. I could be tripping. Maybe I got some weird packs. All right, y'all, let's see if we can get some instant banger action going on here. And it looks like not so much. Dang, that was a fire energy pack too. Crazy. We did get a trainer though. Dude, imagine I get two trainers in a pack from Obsidian Flames. I would do a big flip. Damn. Dude, if I can clean tear open one of these booster packs, I'm going to shave my beard. Like, if I can just grab one and sh it opens up, I'm going I'm to do it. I'm going to shave my beard. And then I'm going to yell at you all and tell you that I didn't make any damn promises and I ain't shaving no damn beards. <laughs> All right, gang, it looks like we finally got something back there. It's a trainer. It's a poppy. It looks like a illustration rare. So y'all know what the damn deal is. It's a full art trainer gallery trainer. I don't know. These damn new rarities piss me off, man. I'm dead ass when I say that. Like, because you think you know what they are, and then you forget what the fuck they are, and then you try to remember, and then you're all like, uh, and then you go read the book, and you're all like, yeah, yeah, that. And then you forget, like, geez, Louise. Hang on, let me go look for a second. And I'm colorblind, so that's neat. But, okay, folks, so I'm pretty sure I have a special illustration rare. Because it's got two gold. Like those are gold stars I think. They could be grey. I don't know. To me even the grey ones look gold. Depending on the way the light hits them. So that's neat. That's probably like a $10 card. Alright gang. It 
let's see what is in this pack behind the phantom and the woofer and the breezel and the whatever the hell that thing was and the lapras behind all that mess average pack all right that's neat I'm gonna try to not to complain as much in this video as i did in the last one but i will be lashing out at you all just the same <laughs> uh, damn these new packs are hard to open Go ahead and give that away. Let me know in the comments below, guys, what y'all been getting from the QR codes. Otherwise, I'm just going to straight up stop giving them to y'all. Yeah, that was a pretty cool little artwork there with the Togepi. I'm seeing some of these cards, and all I'm thinking is they would make really nice keychains. Straight up. You feel me, honey? Look, guys, I got another trainer card. I almost have as many hits as I do trainer cards. I'm not going to lie. In fact, I might have more hits. Ultra rares are better. Or double rares are better, if you'll excuse me. With that whole mess. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and give away the QR code with this one at the very end of the... Uh, you know, where we looking to see what the hell is inside of the packs. You know what I'm saying? Oh, all right. We got a room uh, illustration rare. There's the QR code. Very nice. It's actually pretty cool. Probably worth like five or six bucks. I say probably because like none of these illustration rares ever end up being worth that much. You know what I'm saying? And then even the special illustration rares, like some of those probably only were like 15 to 30 bucks. It's just the way it is. Um, I'm not going to sit here and look up the prices. I'm just giving you an uh, guesstimate of what I think they're probably worth. If anyone out there was wondering, probably no one, but you know. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we reached that point in the video where my knees are getting sore. So I'm going to stand up for a second. Ugh, while I sit here and think about why I need a desk. All right, we're done. Let's go ahead and open the rest of these packs. There's probably like 10 more left. Oh my God. Straight up. So we have another Varum, this time not an illustration rare, but a regular one. And we have this whole mess of cards going on back there. It's kind of cool how we got a Larvitar and a Pupitar like that in sequence. Um, on to the next pack, guys, of Obsidian Flames, where I hopefully will pull a Charizard of some damn kind or a Dragonite. Or Lapras, too. There's Laprases in here. I'm going to go nuts. Read that one upside down if you can. And let me know what you pulled in the comments below. Alright, here we go. We got a chunk. Another one of them Togepis. Another one of them Glues. Glooms, sorry. And nothing. Straight up nothing sandwich, guys, out of this one. I was thinking about doing a master set of Obsidian Flames, guys. Let me know if uh, if I should or not. I definitely want to do one for 151. But I'll probably won't open that many packs. Like, if I did with Pokemon Go and stuff. With Pokemon Go, I opened up so many goddamn packs. Oh my god. And that's only like, what? 100 cards or something? Pokemon Go? Like 112 cards or something. I don't even know. Not that many. I feel like it's not even. I feel like there's only like 80 cards in there. So I'll probably hunt for like reverse hollows and hollows. But all the big hitters I'll probably end up buying. If I don't find any along the way. Of 151. Although it would be smart of me to just wait. And see if I can get the prices to drop on them, you know. 
that always seems to be the smart play with Pokemon cards nowadays is just wait a few months after the product releases and all the prices will be at their lowest they're going to be for a while qr code right there snatch it up get it while it's hot let me know what you pull in the comments below and let's see what's in this pack hopefully there's something nope all right next pack guys we got the varoom pack All right, gang, let's see what we get here behind all this mess. I'd be surprised if there are any uh, commons or uncommons we haven't seen yet at this point. I wouldn't know because Pokemon Center can't fucking stock enough damn ETBs to sell them on launch. They really need to limit how much people can pre-order, like... I haven't been able to buy a damn Pokemon Center ETB from launch since Paldea evolved. Y'all just keep damn pre-ordering the life out of them, dude. And then I'm stuck over here, like, just wait until they print more, I guess. Fuck. <laughs> like, alright, let's see what we get in this pack. Look, we got a trainer. And a Charmander Reverse Hollow, which is probably oddly worth like two bucks. Just because it's the Mender. It is of Char Descent. Alright guys, we have like five more packs here. If you haven't smashed like yet, then uh, your mom's a hoe. So smash like, please. Otherwise, your mama gonna be working the streets tonight. All right, let's see what we can pull out of this pack. So far, straight up nothing out of the right side of the box. Like, nothing. Like, not a damn thing we pulled. Okay, we got the Nine Tails illustration. As I'm saying it, we pulled, like, this card's actually worth, like, five or ten bucks, I think. It's the Nine Tails everyone's going nutty for, right? Not this one in particular. I'm pretty sure it's the other one. But I'm pretty sure Ninetales, Charizard, and Pidgeot are the chase cards of Obsidian Flames. Could be mistaken. Let me know in the comments below. Sometimes I do try to bait you guys into commenting by saying falsified informations. Is this one of those moments? I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, leave a comment, damn. Fuck. Shit. Jeez. Leave a comment already. And like the video, please, just like 10 or 20, I don't know, but but don't be stinky, and if I get to 10, don't be like, oh, 10's all you asked for. Like, like, like the shit out of the video, please. Please? All right, thanks, cool. All right, we got a Clefable EX. Very cool. Another dollar hit. Next pack, guys. We only have three left. This video was obviously a little shorter because uh, the intro wasn't as long. That and I worked out a neat trick where I could just pause the video instead of making you guys wait while I organize my shit. But uh, thanks for tuning in, y'all. Hopefully we can get something out of these last three packs. Otherwise, I'm gonna keep the, the QR codes for the rest for the rest of eternity. You will never see a QR code in my hands again facing your direction. Now I'm playing. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Big old nothing sandwich. Damn, dude. My booster box sucked. But you never know, maybe there's something sweet hiding behind there. In these last two packs. But it seems like most of the magic was in the left side of the booster box. Let me know in the comments below if you guys think that the left side one 
or are you holding out to the end of the video for a fair recap? Big old fat average sandwich right there in that one. Starting to look like maybe that, that energy was like maybe they do somehow know the hits in there and don't give you too many. All right, last pack. If you haven't smashed like yet, smash it for this. If there's anything that you're meant to smash like on in every single Pokemon video, it's last pack magic. So if you haven't yet, smash like, you turd. All right, here we go. Dude, watch. I'm about to get straight up. Like, this video's going to get removed for me just being mean for no reason. All right, that's it, guys. Oh, okay. So we is that the same? Uh, did I pull the same one twice? No way. Hang on. All right. So this is the gray one, right? This is the double gray star. So this is the ultra rare, I believe. That is a pretty sweet coincidence that I got both of them, though. So I ended up getting a special illustration rare. I got in... I don't know. Let's, let's refer back to the manual here. What the hell is that thing called? Double gray stars. Ultra rare. It's a full art trainer, goddammit. Um, so that's kind of neat. I got, what, like two of these? Didn't I get another one? Nope. Didn't I get... Nope. Alright, guys. So, left side, I think one. Okay, you got the... Uh, Whatever the shit this is. Um, what is this? Is that two gold stars? No, that's two gray stars. That's the Ultra Rare, Vespa Queen, EX Terra, the uh, Illustration Rare Pidgey, Pidgeot EX, Tyranitar EX with the Terra. We got Decidueye EX, Pidgeot EX Ultra Rare, and the Special Illustration Rare Basic Energy. I think. Is that what it's called? Or is that one Secret Rare? The Hyper Rare... All right, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven hits out of that side. One, two, three, four, five hits out of that side. I'm not going to sit here and look up the prices. You guys can. Um, here, here are the right side again. Special illustration, Poppy, ultra rare Poppy. Uh, illustration rare, Varum, Clefable EX, and Ninetales illustration rare. Pretty sure left side one. Let me know what you guys think below. You guys want to know what I think? I think it's all bullshit. No, I'm playing. <laughs> but no, uh, I, I think I should have at least gotten a single Charizard. And I mean, I got a Pidgey and I got a Pidgeot full art. But it's this box didn't have entirely everything I wanted in it. But if that's how Pokemon trading card game work, if you could just get a box and everything you wanted was in it, then these cards wouldn't be worth anything. You know what I'm saying? So keep that in mind. All those people that you knew that pulled shit, they were all extremely lucky. I mean, like all the people that pulled all the Charizards and stuff, they got stupid lucky. And uh, yeah, let me know in the comments below what y'all have pulled from Obsidian Flames. Did you have a similar experience to me? Where you ended up with just like, what is this, like less than 20 cards? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Dang, I didn't even get 15 cards. So there you go. 36 packs. I got 12 cards that are probably worth a buck or more. Ah, buying booster boxes sucks, but it's such good content. All right, guys. Love you all so much. Um, make sure you read the comments if you would like some words of inspiration or motivation. And go check out my gaming videos. I'm starting to post those again. Uh, Resident Evil and star wars until we finish those i don't know what we're gonna play next love y'all take care and later